I think uh, the world that we live in or the world that we operate in, technology is evolving every day, right? It, it, as a matter of fact, it, it probably is evolving as we speak as well. So every day technology is getting better and better and better. And which is why you need to upskill as well. You cannot stay at the same point because the, tech, the gap increases. So every time you have to reduce that gap between the technology and what you do. Hi, uh, I'm Devanshi Mishra. Uh, I work here as a product manager. Uh, have been here for around three and a half ish years. Joined Newton School back in 21, I guess, as an intern. I did my uh, double major from Bits Pilani uh, in Mechanical Engineering and Economics. EdTech brings that education uh, in the most in the most qualitative way, in the most uh, refined way, from the best people at your doorstep at your convenience uh, and helps you bridge that gap, right? So that you become better, you become the leader of tomorrow and do better in life. Uh, breaking down student patterns into how much time uh, are, they spend, uh, are they spending in learning, how much time are they spending in solving questions, how much questions are they solving and how it progresses to their placements and everything. Uh, and it eventually helped us and helped our teams better uh, in the way to push students to do, for example, X number of questions, X number of lectures, uh, which resulted in great placement for them. In these three years, the product team has evolved a lot. I mean, we have shipped countless products uh, and made the user experience better. To name a few things that I have personally worked upon, uh, we pivoted from Zoom to our own classroom. Uh, we call it Newton School Super Classroom. Uh, it, it has some superpowers. It, it uh, does engage the students in a great way. Uh, people can chat. People can uh, you know throw emojis. People can collaboratively code uh, with the instructors, which happens nowhere uh, else from what I know. Uh, and a lot of other tools as well, right? For example, we have our in-house evaluation systems, we have our in-house proctoring tools. So a lot of things uh, which which essentially means that anyone who is coming to Newton School gets an entire package of all the products that are available in bits and pieces out there. So yeah, I mean the product team has evolved and the products that we have built have evolved a lot in the last couple of years definitely. So what we do in the master class is someone from, an, from, from one of these prestigious uh, companies who will be teaching them from 10, to 10 months or something uh, comes to them, teaches them for 2 hours uh, which gives them a flavour of what or how Newton School teaches and how their journey would look like. They should know what they are getting into. Over this period, period I, I think I've talked to around around 600, 700 students and there, there are a lot of stories but there was this particular person who was attempting for UPSC, was trying for UPSC, had attempted around 5 attempts or something, uh, was pretty heartbroken that he did not get selected. Uh, his marriage was just on the cards, uh, the bride was all selected everything and all he had to do was get, get a job because no one was you know trusting him. Uh, he ended up joining Newton School, got placed in 5 months at a good salary, got married. So what better uh, ending for, for, for him, right? Being here at Newton School, handling multiple projects, which are equally important for a student, has just taught me how to manage multiple things all together and be better at it. Being empathetic to people, a lot of students come from different backgrounds, uh, have different challenges, are working for the same outcome, and uh, you know, interacting with them for all this while has made me had taught has taught me how to be kind to them, how to understand their problems, and be empathetic to them. So I would strongly suggest people to go after you know classes or teaching which allows them to interact back with the expert because that part teaches you a lot. Go after practical knowledge. There's a lot of theoretical stuff that is all around, but. Uh, People just don't know how to apply it in the real life, right? So go after something which teaches you how to apply that theoretical stuff into your practical life uh, in a very practical way. Gives you the community, gives you the alum network, uh, people who will always be around you, people who will always help you become better in your life. Something that I would have advice to the three years younger me as well is, uh, don't judge a book by its cover. There's a lot that happens behind, you know, the uh, rumors that go all about edtech. 
uh so yeah i mean take take them take some time it's a difficult place to be in education education is super important for a lot of people uh so take some time uh, understand what people are doing and uh, and you will see great outcomes coming definitely